Markets closed last week with the fears that the US economy may enter recession. Runaway inflation and the need to raise the rate may negatively affect the recovery process after a long period of coronavirus crisis. Find out more about the state of the foreign exchange, crypto and commodities markets in our video review. The US dollar index, which measures its value against the basket of six major currencies, closed last week with a gain of 0.59%, having closely approached the level of 99 points. The intention of the Fed officials to take a more aggressive stance on the monetary policy and the hike the rate by 50 basis points supports the US dollar. The Fed is forced to take such steps due to extremely high consumer prices that have reached their peak in the last 40 years. The single European currency ended the session below 1.10 against the US dollar, its lowest level since May 2020. At the same time, expectations grow that the European Central Bank will follow suit of other regulators and raises the rate at least twice this year. At its last meeting, the ECB announced the acceleration of the asset purchase program, although ECB head Christine Lagarde denied it was monetary tightening and said that the regulator was not going to rush to raise the rate, given the current dynamic of the fair traders refrain from buying the euro. In the meantime, the pound sterling managed to stay strong despite the greenback's appreciation across the boat. However, in the middle of the week, the pound reached a three-week low against the US dollar. The Bank of England has already raised the rate twice and still considers more policy tightening in the future. Like in most global economies, inflation in the UK is running at record levels. Yet the UK regulator gives a pessimistic outlook on the situation which is why markets seem to be more prepared for the negative scenario on inflation. Meanwhile, crypto traders were more optimistic last week. Bitcoin advanced by 8% by the end of the week, having approached the resistance level of $45,000 per token. Bitcoin bulls are likely to develop the uptrend further in the new weekly session. As for the commodities market, oil is still extending its rally. Brand crude went higher by 8.5% over the last week to return to the level of $120 per barrel. Crude prices remain high also due to reports about attacks on oil facilities in Saudi Arabia. Apart from this, oil traders are still worried about supply disruptions amid the sanctions against Russia. Other factors that push prices higher are the suspension of the Caspian pipeline due to damage caused by the storm and the decline in the oil reserves in the United States. Gold also posted gains last week as investors prefer to stay with the low-risk assets amid the ongoing Russia-Ukraine conflict and high inflation. As the result of the NATO summit in Brussels, the members refused to provide military assistance to Ukraine and um, condemned Russia's auctions. The precious metal gained 2% in value. You have watched combined review on our currency, commodity, markets on InstaForex TV channel. We wish you profitable trading and see you soon.